the ground first in the right corner and it's on the left of the street. Okay. Get to the ground class and take it only in front of you. Okay. Yes? okay. Hello viewers, let's take a walk around the old part of Brussels, the capital of Belgium. It is presently a cosmopolitan city and is home to the European Parliament, the European Commission and the European Council. It is said to have founded in the year 979. Like most European cities, it's an absolute pleasure to walk along the old part of the town. Brussels is also the birthplace of Tintin. Being big fans of Tintin, we wanted to buy a Tintin souvenir from this place of birth. Keep watching to find out how it turned out. With a long and storied history which make it an attraction and can easily pass unnoticed for the majority of tourists, the mannequin piss has become a symbol of Brussels. The mannequin piss was designed in 1388 and is one of the most representative and loved symbols of Brussels, originally serving as the means by which many Bruxellois received water. It is a small bronze statue that measures 50 centimeters and represents a small naked boy urinating into a fountain's basin. It is located in the old part of town. In 1698, a governor gave the little statue its first tunic. It was the first of a thousand outfits the mannequin place owns currently. Hello. Do you have any any souvenirs any pertaining to Tintin? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Behind that is the food. No. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Okay. The tenure of the shop. Oh, where? Yes, where? It's in the corner. Okay, thank you. Elles peuvent être glamour, comme exclusives. Certaines sont locales, d'autres viennent d'ailleurs. Uh, chocolat, you have the... Okay, this, you have the mur du Tintin, you have chocolat. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. 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 
We can't come in. We are leaving tomorrow. Can we come in? Can we come in now? No. Oh. Yeah, we are leaving tomorrow morning. We we'll need some something for Tim Tim. Yeah, we just closed. It just we just missed it by a minute. Oh. Where? Oh. Across the right corner, and it's on the left of the street. Okay. Get to the front class and take it from in front of you. Okay. okay. On the right. Okay. In that street on the left. Okay. okay. It's a little bit inside. Oh, okay. The shop. Okay. okay. You love what's, it. what's it called? What's the name Stinting of the shop? Stinting shop. Stinting okay. shop. Okay. Thank you. We were quite surprised to find out that not many people in Brussels know about Tintin and we had a hard time getting some Tintin, Tintin souvenir. We went to a number of shops but none carried anything related to Tintin and for that matter Hercule Poirot too. However, we did, some, we did find some Sherlock Holmes stuff. So with lots of disappointment we resigned to our fate. So long till next time. La Grande Place or the Great Square is the heart of Brussels and the most visited and photographed place in the city. This lively cobbled square is part of the most beautiful 17th century architectural ensemble in Belgium. With tens of famous buildings including the town hall and the king's house, architecturally speaking it's one of the most beautiful squares in Europe. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe and see you in the next one.